I gotta wait for the dog to stop drinking water in order to record because it sounds like he's drinking a big slurpee. So, give it a second. Come on, Nemo. You can do it. You can do it. Are we done? Sounds like we're done. Nope. He's thirsty. Hey guys, it's Obota here at Hip and Creative. Welcome to my channel. So today is a Target Dollar Spot haul. It's been a little while since I've hauled anything for you guys and I'm really excited to share things with you. Now these are not going to be super original items. You may have seen other people haul these. These are Valentine's Day decor items that they're going to be hauling for their decorations. Um, I decided to grab some of these items because um, I fell in love with them. I thought they were gorgeous and I am in the process of redoing my laundry room. I have a nice size laundry room in which I use half of it for my craft items that I store there and I do some of my uh, plan with me videos or any, um, any uh, videos outside of the ones where you see my dining room. So the purpose of me going to my local Target this past weekend was because I wanted to get some of these items so I can use them for my craft room as room decor. Now even though they're uh, going to be Valentine's Day related, I try to choose items that I can use all year long that may have that Valentine's Day look to it, but I can also use it throughout the entire year and not just specifically for that one moment. Um, if you're new to my channel, welcome. And uh, just to give you a brief little about me, um, my name is Avolta. This is Hip and Creative where I share home decor, haul videos, DIY videos, craft, and also some clean with me as well as organization videos. Um, we're like DIYers and we like to uh, renovate this house. We're in the process of renovating it room by room. So if you're into those type of videos, you are more than welcome to hit that subscribe button and make sure to click on that little bell icon at the bottom of your screen there. Uh, it helps to you be notified of videos that I post and I post videos every week sometimes twice a week. I definitely am in the process of trying to keep up with a schedule of a two times a week video. So without further delay, I am going to jump right into the very first item that I'm going to show you and which is, is really pretty. It's a pin board and it comes with these pins and I'm sure you've seen other people haul these. Uh, I chose this design because it does not have, some of them came with stripes, some of them came with the word love in it or whatnot. And I prefer to have it that it didn't have anything on it because that way I can showcase my pins here. This is a pin board, so I want to showcase my pins. And I'm not one big on having it have like too much design or decor. I'm a very clean line type of person. I don't mind some decorative elements to things, but I'm more of a plain Jane, very clean, very subtle look. And I thought this was very, very pretty. And of course, with these pins that come with it, you can pin the front of it and then flip it over to the other side. And you can use the chalkboard side to just write little messages like hello, love, or whatever it is you want to write. So I thought that was a great find. And I believe this was $5. So if you want to spend $5 to get this, this is definitely, I think, worth it. So the other item I wanted to share with you from this dollar spot was this really beautiful gold mug. I thought this was gorgeous. I mean, this was $3. As you can see, it's white on the inside. And it has gold polka dots on the outside. And I thought this was gorgeous. And I'm going to be obviously drinking out of this mug. I am not a coffee drinker. I don't drink coffee. It actually does not agree with me. But I do drink like cocoa. And um, I'm starting to drink some tea. And, but I usually drink like water and juices and milk and so I like this. But if I don't use this as a drinking uh, mug, I was also thinking of using it as a decorative element for my office and just kind of twist it this way so you can see the polka dots and not really the fact that it's a mug. And you can use it to store pencils, you can use it to store maybe push pins in there. Anything you can think of that you'd want to just corral in here is a great idea. And I thought this was a great find. Um, another item that I got from the Dollar Spot were these stamps. Now, I do um, Plan With Me videos and I also 
thought of using like I was going to make my own sticker sheets in which I would have little icons on there to kind of help me be a little more organized in my weekly scheduling and I thought this was really cool because it has different little icons like if you went to the dentist if you're going to the doctors if you want to have some coffee day with someone you know workout days but if you're going to take your pooch to the vet or your kitty to the vet and it just I just thought it was really really cool if you have travel ideas and I thought this was a great idea to have this as um, stamps for my planner I thought that was a great find so some other items I got here were these um, Valentine's Day cards I got this for my youngest daughter they were three dollars a box it comes in the back I'll show you it comes with these little puppies and I thought that was really cute we're dog lovers here and so I also love cats but my husband unfortunately is allergic to cats if not I would totally have cats but so far we have to be dog lovers sorry kitties but it's the pooch ones it comes with the pencils and it comes with the stickers and uh, she's going to be handing these out to her classmates I sometimes do DIY products you know DIY, do, I sometimes DIY Valentine's Day gifts for the kids but this year I thought it was just a quick little buy give it to them and it'll come from her so I thought that was a great find the other item I got was this stamp. I thought this was cute. It was a stamp set. Um, I have an Etsy shop where I do party supplies. And um, this, I thought this stamp was really cute. And it says the stamp itself is going to say special delivery. I don't know if you can see that through the packaging here. Um, it's, it's really, really cute. I thought the packaging was really cute. And I thought it was a great idea. So when I do my deliveries and I send out items that I'm going to be sending to my customers I can put a little stamp on it saying special delivery and I thought it was a really great personal touch and it was only three bucks I thought it was a great investment for my business side of things so that was an awesome find for me okay so these other items that I found from the um, Target store were not from the actual Target dollar spot but was from their Valentine's section where they have their candies and um, I have to show you that I fell in love with these adorable they're adorable look look at this look at this adorable it's M&Ms with emojis on them I, I mean I got two boxes and I have an idea of I'm gonna be doing some Valentine's Day stuff with the kiddos and I thought I'd share with you online what I'm going to be doing so these are adorable and I love them and I'm totally geeking out about these. I have to say, I I, I, I accidentally came across one of my Instagram feeds and on my Instagram, I can't remember who posted a picture of the M&M's and they were doing, they're like a baker so they were doing some sort of baking goods with it and somehow they used the M&M's kind of like props on the table kind of they sprinkled it on there and I believe the M&M's were in the cake itself and so when I saw that I was like I have to have the emoji M&M's they are too cute I cannot skip out on those so the first thing I did when I got to Target was went straight to the candy aisle with my husband and we looked up and down the aisles until we found them and they come in either black or white boxes and they're cute 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 I love them adorable I love them okay so um, moving on I'm going to be showing you my let's see now oh right here container okay so I have found this really pretty container it is three dollars it's kind of like a like a canister it's taped down and uh, I, I just thought it was pretty awesome I believe it's just one size taped down it comes out and it has this filigree kind of bottom here on the lid and the inside is just white and of course it's to just house some knickknack items that I want to put in here and make the office look a little neater and I got it in white it, I believe it comes in other colors like white and then there's pink and then there's I believe red but in my local Target, this was like the last one there. So if not, I would have gotten two of these. But they only had the one, so I got this one. And they also had, which, excuse me for one second. Let me check. So 
this canister I also got from for three dollars at the Target dollar spot and I just like the idea that it's white it's clean it's just very pretty I think the little gold heart knob up top here is really really cute and I, I totally like this and the inside kind of it's just white there's nothing you know too spectacular about the inside it's a great canister to house many things inside and I thought I just kind of even though they don't match I like the idea of them being white and pretty like this so I'm excited to be adding this to my office area so another item I got from the Target Dollar Spot was this um, this ceramic trinket dish a trinket dish so I got this because I thought it was really really pretty instead of using it as a trinket dish to put little knickknacks on it whatnot I was thinking of actually hanging this on my wall what do you think guys cute right I think it's a great idea to hang this on the wall very pretty little decorative plate that can hang on the wall with some other decorative items and I thought that would be really really cute so I am in love with this they only had this one left guys that's it just this one so so far even with the canisters it was just the one left I mean people were picking this target clean so now the next item I wanted to share with you was this really cute um, satin heart set I thought this is the silver and the red it has the red some of them have like the full red on them and then some of them have like the silver in the front and then the red in the back I thought that was a great find it's a dollar um, yeah I was they also had like a gold version and I actually went out there looking for the gold version and they had none and this is the only one they had again picked dry I actually found this kind of buried deep inside a bunch of kind of miscellaneous things and it, I, I'm guessing someone wanted to hold off on getting it and threw it there or maybe somebody was kind of picking through and just fell to the bottom I'm not sure but I thought this was a great find now with this what I'm going to be doing is I'm probably going to be using it as kind of like when you know how when you do your photos um, or videos and you use items for props in your photography so you have like sprinkled confetti or you put like miscellaneous items on the table to kind of do like a above shot to shoot the picture down um, I think they're called flat lays and so for my Etsy shop I'm going to be taking some photos of products that I'll be uploading soon to my Etsy shop and just to freshen up the page I thought I'd add some color content and the heart the satin hearts is going to be one of the items that I'm going to be using as props for my photos and I, you might also see them on my Instagram account so if you do follow me on Instagram.com um, my, my, my handle is at hip and creative so that's pretty much all my social media handles is at hip and creative so you can totally check it out there and I'll post a link as well on the bottom of this uh, what do you call it on the bottom of my description box I'll post a link in my description box to all my social media accounts I don't know what's wrong with me guys I can't talk today now the next item I wanted to share with you were these really pretty wood clips I thought they were really 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 cute I love them um, I, I don't know I'm really into gold and copper and silver like the metallic colors I really like them and uh, when I do my home my home has a lot of neutrals in it and that's more our style we like neutral colors so there's a lot of grays and tans in our decor and a white and um, I thought that for my office I would make it a little more colorful and I am going to be having gold and copper elements in there but I thought to also incorporate colors and I don't it doesn't bother me the pinks don't bother me I like pink pinks a nice color I'm more of a kind of like a teal or aqua color girl I'm not sure what color scheme I'm going to be leaning towards but I thought this was a great find to add to it and it was just one dollar great finds I think um, some other items here that I got were these really cute mini cards now I thought they were really really cute they're tiny and I'm going to be um, giving Valentine's Day gifts for my nieces and nephews and I I fell in love with these cards they're tiny and they're cute and it says love and this one says I believe it says always and forever and then this one has the back of the card or the envelope itself has kind of like this I'm sorry the back of the card has these arrows on them and then the other one just has the plain um, backing 
but I thought that was really really cute and it's very simple and it was a dollar for this one I also got another style here which is this one here I thought that was really cute and adorable and then the other set that I got was this one here I thought that was also cute and adorable So I'm going to be handing out cards to my nieces and nephews this year. And these are the cards I'll be giving them. I thought it was something cute and fun and different. Another item I got from my home office is this wood tray. I thought this was really, really pretty. I mean, you could probably fit, I'm thinking, you can probably use it for like washi and whatnot. But I don't know. To me, I just thought this was really pretty. It has a gold bottom here. Now, I'm going to show you. I believe I wanted to get more than just one. They only had the one. And I have to say, it's a little frustrating that I wasn't able to go earlier in the season to get some items like this. I thought this was very pretty and very cool to have. And I'm going to be using it as a display piece on my home office. And I thought this was really cute. It has the gold. And as you can see, the theme I'm going for so far is kind of like a gold and white theme. And if not gold and white, it's also a rose gold or a copper color that I'm going to be going for. And this, I just, when I saw someone haul this, and I'm sorry, I can't remember who it was that, that hauled this. I sometimes go on YouTube and I just randomly look at Target dollar hauls or I look at Dollar Tree hauls, but I don't really um, memorize whom I see it from. I just kind of try to remember items that I've seen. So when I go out there, I pick what I like and and uh, if I do find them, I find them. If not, then it's boo on me. But um, this is very cute. It's $5. I think it's worth the $5. Some people think that's a bit pricey. But you can do a lot of things. You can kind of like lay it flat on your table. And you can corral things in there. You can sit it here. You can separate this gold piece here. And have two different, you know, you can separate them. Have two different decorative pieces on your office. Or your bedroom. Or your children's room. So this was a great find in my opinion. So, um... We're almost towards the end here, guys, and thank you so much for bearing with me. So, some of the items that were not in the Target dollar spot section, which was still a good price, was this um, wooden gold celebrate banner. I thought that was really awesome, and I'm going to be using this for future birthday parties, as well as when I do my party supply um, um, photography. I'll probably use this as props in the background. The second to last item I'm going to be sharing with you is this really pretty tassel banner. Um, it's garland, I guess they call it garland, I don't know, but I, I, I thought it was really pretty. It's gold, it's pink, it's got like neutral colors on it, it's really pretty. It Once again, it's going to go into my home office and uh, same thing like to celebrate. You can probably pair the two together, have this in the back and this in the forefront and have it kind of like say celebrate that way. Or you can use it two separate banners hung on your wall, maybe draped across your table. You can use it for photography. You can use it as props. You can use it for your actual cele celebration. So if you have a birthday party, that's your color scheme for that birthday party. You can totally use it. Obviously, it is for birthday parties. And so the last but not least item that I found at the Target, uh, not the dollar spot, but at my local Target, was this You Plus Me um, I believe it's kind of like a like a like an LED sign, and it was eight dollars, and I thought that was a great find, and I didn't put any ba batteries in it yet, but it does take, uh, I believe, some AA batteries, and you can open it up in the back, comes out with this little instruction sheet, and yes, it takes two uh, AA batteries. So if you in the look if you're on the hunt for these. You can definitely find them in the seasonal section, not the um, dollar spot section. Okay, guys, that's everything for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please make sure to leave me a thumbs up. And let me know in the comments down below, what was your favorite item from this video? I have to say, I have several favorites. One of them is this mug here. The other one is this You Plus Me sign. I thought that was adorable. And I really do enjoy everything that I've hauled today. And I hope you did too. Also, I'm going to be doing a kind of like a get to know me video that I'll be posting sometime this week. 
I'm hoping to have it up by Wednesday or Friday. So um, if you have any comments or any questions that you'd like to ask me, you can definitely leave them down in the comments below and I'll make sure to incorporate them into my Get to Know Me video. Until next time, guys, I hope you have a great day. God bless and I'll see you guys on the next video. Bye.